look what we have here. This is a pretty cool microphone, man. Will this be the killer for our SM7B or our Rode Procaster? I don't know. I haven't heard it yet. Uh, we'll, of course, have some Mic Wars videos featuring this microphone. And of course, with the SM7B Procaster, maybe a condenser I haven't decided yet. And of course, you know, shortly after this video, we'll have a full review of the Aston microphone's stealth. But in this video, we're just going to uh, unbox it. And like I said, this is a pretty killer uh, microphone. You'll see why in a minute. All right, go ahead and take a look at the box for those interested in that sort of thing. Now, one thing you might notice here on the box, and this is sort of the really cool thing. Number one, it's got four voice settings, okay? But the super cool thing is this has a Class A mic preamp built in, right? A Class A mic preamp built in. You know what that means, right? No need for a cloud lifter. Now this is a dynamic microphone, a large format dynamic microphone, just like our, our Shure SM7B and our Rode Procaster are sort of that large format. But uh, both of those will require quite a bit of amplification, you know, using a preamp or your cloud lifter into your audio interface preamp. This, guess what? You can run this in passive or active mode. And again, the preamp is built in. That's pretty cool. How does it sound again? No clue, dude. I haven't unboxed it yet, so let's go ahead and uh, do that there. Go ahead and uh, ba boom, pull that out. And that was a uh, sticker there. Read the inside of the box for those interested in such things. Here is your owner's manual. Pretty cool. I'll uh, grab some B roll of it and uh, throw it up there to the camera for those interested. Now we'll grab the microphone. Good size microphone there, good weight to it. Not overly heavy, but good weight to it. We'll set that aside for now. What is this here? Look under me. All right, so we'll pull that out. I'm hiding some more goodies. <laughs> That's kind of funny, actually. Okay, what's we got here? Looks to be an Aston. We get in frame here, a pin there. To throw B roll up there since I wasn't in frame. And this, another cool thing, this is our clip, right? So instead of like a shock mount or a you know a standard kind of a you know stand for this microphone, this actually clips into the microphone. Again, we'll go into full detail in this in the actual demo video, but uh, it's a pretty cool system they have. And what else is in here? The, uh, the twist, because we have four different voices on this microphone that you get to with just a uh, simple twist. So that is everything that's in the box. Obviously not our SM7B cloud lifter or the Procaster, but this uh, stuff right here, everything that's in the box uh, there. Let's go ahead and pull the microphone out of the packaging here real quick. And there is the microphone. It's a pretty good size length and uh, length and width, very directional microphone, rejects sounds, obviously from the sides there. Down here, of course, your serial number there. There's a button here that's supposed to turn on a light, turn on or off a light. Whenever you're feeding this microphone, this dynamic microphone, phantom power, it engages that included, that integrated class A preamp. And there's a light here that will let you know when it's on or, or, uh, or not. So you can turn that on or off, obviously XLR, right there and right in here is where you put your clip. Again, we'll have a full demo of this, but essentially look at the uh, the molding on that there, okay? Just stick it in there, kind of have to push. You'll hear it click and there we go. It's pretty secure. When you're done, just pull it out. So pretty, uh, pretty ingenious. This microphone has an included integrated uh, shock system. You can actually shake the microphone and feel it kind of shake around in there. Uh, we'll, again, we'll get into uh, more of that in the video, but uh, in the uh, you know, full review video there, but that's essentially what we have here in the box of our Aston Microphones Stealth. So if we compare real quick, sort of the size here between the Procaster, Procaster's a bit longer, Stealth a bit wider there, and then the Procaster here, or the uh, SM7B, uh, SM7B a bit heavier, but then again, I have the yoke on it uh, as well. 
So probably about the same uh, uh, weight there, and about the same about the same length uh, overall. Again, I mentioned this has four discrete paths uh, that we can choose, kind of like the Shure SM7B, how we can switch our uh, frequency responses there, you know, base roll off, presence boost. This one here has V1, V2, G, and D. V1 is mainly, or at least it's set up for male vocals, V2 for female vocals, of course. You know, you can use what, you know, use whatever works for you. G is made uh, for guitar, and D is a dark setting, which uh, emulates sort of the sound you get from classic ribbon microphones. And to switch this up, you can't just use your fingers. It's not gonna, you know, it's not gonna accidentally change uh, uh, mid-session. So grip it good, and you can switch it as such there. So pretty, uh, pretty easy, pretty handy to do. Switches the overall response of this microphone. And again, whenever this dynamic microphone is fed a 48 volt or phantom signal, it uh, switches to that active circuit. It's gonna be uh, interesting to test this out in comparison with something like the SM7B Procaster with our Cloud Lifter and this here with its integrated uh, preamp. All right, so that's all for the sort of behind the scenes unboxing of our Aston Microphone Stealth. You can always go check these guys out at astonmics.com. And coming up pretty soon after this video will be the full demo of our Aston Microphones Stealth. <laughs>